Hi, and in today's video, I'm going to show you several different ways you can delete a blank page in Word. So as you can see, I've got a document up here with two blank pages in my document. Now, the first blank page, as you can see, my cursor's at the top here. If I try and click anywhere else on this page, then my cursor doesn't move down the page. If I click anywhere on this page, my cursor will move down the page with me. So sometimes you'll have return keys on your page and sometimes you won't because you've used a page break. So if I just go to the Home tab and go along to this icon here called Show or Hide Format Marks, you can see that I've got all of these little blue markers all over my document. If we just zoom in, these markers here are return keys or the Enter key. And as I delete them, let's just zoom out. As I press the delete key, you can see that I start to delete my return keys. Now to get rid of this blank page, I can just simply select all of those delete keys by clicking and dragging and just continue to delete them. Put my cursor next to that text there, just press the delete key and then I've deleted that page. That's when you've got some return keys on your blank page. You need to delete all of them to get rid of that blank page. Now, secondly, we can see that we've got a page break here, no return keys, and we've also got a page break here. Now, I can put my cursor here and then press delete, and it will delete that page break. Again, I can put my cursor here and delete that page break. Once I delete those page breaks, then I will delete the page. So I hope that's helped you today. If it has, please subscribe and have a great day.